Okay, and the only one hitch to this whole process is that once you reinstall this theme, it's going to um, change your username and password to the one that we have set up for the original. So what you're going to have to do is once you upload a theme to your new site, you're going to have to use this username and password to log in. Okay, so this is very important. Once you log in to the site, you're going to want to go to user, go to all users. You're going to want to add a new user, which will be your user. And you're going to want to delete this username and password immediately, right? Cause everyone's going to have it, but just log in and then, and then delete it. So to add a new one is very easy. You just add a new one. You can put your information, whatever you want. You can put your email in here right you can um, put your first name last name you know all your information right that's right and then it's going to automatically generate a password you're going to want to do administrator you're going to want to add new all right once we have created that new user we want to go over to edit and we want to make sure we grab the password, update user. Now we're going to want to delete this one, but we cannot delete it if we're logged in. So we're going to want to log out. And then we're going to want to log back in as the new user that we just created. Go to all users, click on this and delete and apply. So we can just attribute all content to me, confirm. Now we have our own unique username and password. This is very important that you guys do this step right away after you upload the theme.